What is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King Johnson. Before and today, I'm here to bring you guys more gameplay from the Overwatch Open beta. And by the way, the beta is already closed. It ended in May 7th. And if you guys saw my last video, I kept saying that the Open beta is still open, and uh, it's not. You know, the Overwatch Open beta is already done. So it ended in May 7th. Sorry for the misguided information. It's just that I didn't know I was going to schedule that video on Monday, and I didn't know the Monday was already going to be the 8th. So kind of misguided information there. Not sorry for it. So uh, honest mistake. So anyways, um, when the Overwatch releases, I'll be getting the game. It looks sweet, it looks nice, the graphics are cool, the weapons are nice, uh, the, the abilities from each character, they are really creative. So um, I like it, man. I'm gonna pick it up on day one, and I do recommend it, by the way. And um, if you guys saw my review, you know, pretty much, I'll tell you guys there, there that um, I would buy this game on day one. And hopefully it does have like a like a collectible figurine, like in Battleborn, because that would be nice to have. And also maybe they can sell it separately, so I can like get some more collectibles along the way. So and maybe give out some some of you uh, some of the collectibles that I received. So that would be nice things to do to you guys. So anyways, um, today's character that we're gonna be using for Mortal Watch is called Junkrat. Now this guy, if you go back to Modern Warfare 2, Call of Duty 4, you know you will call this guy the biggest noob of all time because you know his only gun is a grenade launcher. But, since we're playing some kind of defend game mode, you know, we're pretty much going to have to bring out the big guns and also set some traps and, you know, use explosive against the big guys because, you know, the big guys are not that easy to take out. So I decided to use Junk Rat and the guy did a hell of a job setting out traps so people won't get close to me. Look at this big robot, pretty much of a big target. And big targets, you know, they're pretty much easy to take down. But smaller targets with a grenade launcher, it's kind of not going to work. Just make sure you shoot on their legs to get like an easier, easier shot and easier damage, you know, because... Um, if you shoot directly at them, of course you're going to miss because they're skinny, they're small, and they're pretty much going to be avoiding all your shots. So be careful with smaller targets. Bigger targets like the this guy right here, this machine, and um, that guy with the big ass hammer, you know, pretty much easy targets to take out. And also always lay down the traps where you think they're always going to come out from. So you will be a lot more safer. And once they get trapped, you hit them with the grenade launcher. That's pretty much what I did in this whole gameplay. It was pretty fun, man. It was pretty fun using this character and I recommend him every time you use defend though. If you're going to attack, I don't know, man, because since nobody's rushing towards you, there's no, there's no point in using the trap. So you got to think twice in using when uh, using, you know, junk rat when you're playing attack instead of defend so um, he's the best defender so far that I've been using and uh, he's been he's been really effective I think I'm like so far 2-0 oh with him I only used it two times so I'm still 2-0 oh with the guy so uh, he's a good guy as you can see look at John Marston up there John Marston oh getting an attack from behind as you can see he was like pretty much stable there so I wouldn't miss the shot of course so it was just a two shot kill against a smaller target like that look at this robot trying to rush in my, my freaking partner John Marston number two Takes him out, defends my ass, throw a C4, doesn't do a lot of damage. That's one thing I really want to question. Does the C4 really does not do a lot of damage? I think it only does like 100 HP damage. I'm not sure, but um, I need to really study more on that shit. So, overall, Drunk Red is the best defender so far that I've been using. Also, there's another guy who builds turrets. If you guys saw the beginning of the video, there's another guy who's building turrets. And he's a good guy. It's just that his weapon really sucks. So, that's why I switched off from him over to Junk Rat, And I did better with Junk Rat. Also, his special is that little tire right there in the bottom. It's a pretty badass special. It's just like a, you just explode in the middle of the enemy, and they'll take him, they'll be taken down like in one shot. So, it's a good special, man. I recommend it. Every, every time they they capture him flags, you know, just send the wheel over there, and you kill like freaking triples or even quads with that one explosion. So it's a badass character, guys. I recommend it every time you defend the flag or the base or whatever. So. If you guys want to see more Overwatch and more gameplays about FPS gaming, make sure you subscribe for more because there's more more stuff coming up, guys.